Demonstration of the accumulation of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere. The accumulation of carbon dioxide in the Earth's atmosphere occurs only in the Northern Hemisphere. Obviously, there is emission in the Southern Hemisphere too, but there is no accumulation. An action plan that transforms degenerated agricultural lands into agroforests would transform humans into guardians of agroforests, which would sequester all the carbon dioxide accumulation that we produce now, as well as that which we already produced in the industrial period, and in this way we humans would regenerate biodiversity and also solve all the other challenges, such as zoonoses, that we cause. The accumulation of carbon dioxide from vegetation is shown in orange. Carbon dioxide from the north does not spread southwards because the Amazon rainforest, along with two other tropical rainforests, absorbs all the carbon dioxide that approaches each day, and does this in less than 12 hours of photosynthesis, the green flicker. The green flicker in South America etc. is proof of this. The green phase of the flicker is nothing more than the accumulation of vegetation carbon dioxide during the night. The phase without green is nothing more than the complete absorption of carbon dioxide during the 12 daytime hours with daylight and photosynthetic activity. In short, during the day tropical forests preventively clean the planet of carbon dioxide, etc. and efficiently and without any human input transform challenges like carbon dioxide, methane, nitrous oxide, etc. into massive amounts of biomass including wood, energy, food and biodiversity. According to science and the UN, biodiversity is a barrier against the development of zoonoses such as the coronavirus and 700,000 other zoonoses. Until to date, activists, etc. have not presented an effective action plan. All it takes is an action plan that transforms unproductive agricultural land into agroforests which would solve all human challenges. Humans just need to harvest what the agroforests produce. The decomposition of prunings and unharvested parts naturally fertilizes and regenerates agroforests. Such agroforests are a source of income for all farmers, entrepreneurs and humans in the world and produce much more food, materials, energy and biodiversity than the entire world produces today. You already participate in this action plan by liking this video sharing it and subscribing to this channel.